old famous Big Daddy. All the way from the Bahamas at Goldie's Restaurant and Bar. These are males and female count. Each female count lays more than 1,500 eggs. They're vegetarians. All they eat is sand and grass. They take like two and a half years up to three years to mature this size. Now, this is how we get them out of the shell. First, we give it a little bang in the back of the shell. Then we use a butter knife to release it from the shell. Put your fingers through hold them by their feet and you just pull it out. Okay, this is a female count. How do I know? This is a private part right here by myself. Anytime you see that line on a count, that represents a female. Okay? These are the eyes. The middle section is the mouth. This is the breast part. And that's a, a, uh, a private part. But this is my favorite part on the count right here. What is that? This is like that famous blue pill in America. We call it the Bahamian Viagra. I eat about 100 every day. That's why they call me Big Daddy. <laughs> so good. Now I'm going to clean it for you. To show you which part is edible. This part here I'm taking off, this is fish bait. We catch a lot of snappers and groupers with this part every day in the Bahamas. Now I'm gonna cut off the eyes, the mouth and the breast all at one time. If you notice this conch is still alive, conch is only muscle, it's a seashell. They're not like hermit crabs, can move from shell to shell. Once you pull them out, they're done. We try to eliminate most of the dark part to get to the white meat of the conch. And here is the stomach, the intestine. Remember I told you they only eat sand and grass so you wouldn't find that much in them. So what we do, we just eliminate that spot, clean it out nicely. You can also use this for fish bait too. Then we're gonna cut our poor little feet off. This little girl will never walk again in life. Poor little kid. We also make jewelries with this. We take off all the meat, we polish them up. They make necklaces and earrings. You can find these in the straw market right at this moment by abundance. Then we clean this again, but we clean it with lime or salt that eliminates the slime from the conch. Then you'll be able to get like conch salad, squash conch, crack conch, steam conch, stew conch, grilled conch, conch fritters, conch chowder, curry conch, pepper conch. You get conch right out. And that's how it's done in the Bahamas. Thank you. What's There's a lot of conch out there in the ocean. Millions of them. Don't let nobody tell you we have no shortage on count. None at all. The hardest time to get this is like cold fronts and stormy weathers. What they do, they bury themselves under the sun when it's too cold. Nobody want to go to dive them. So the markets get empty. Summertime, these are scornful, baby. You could walk and just pick them up any type of way, in any kind of way. Low water, high water, any kind of water. Okay? Your time, buddy. What's your name? Rex. Rex would like to try it. Where, where oh, you from? Okay. Where you from? Hawaii. Hawaii? Oh. Come around. <laughs> come around, come around. Come around, come around. Okay, you next, buddy. Yeah, yeah, I'm good. I'm on the way now. Rex, Mr. Rex. This, this dude? I'm sorry for your wife tonight, Rex. <laughs> now, if you eat that... Do you chew this? You can chew it or you can swallow it. Okay. Once chew you go down... With no size effect. I'm sorry for you, little lady. <laughs> you can feel like Rex is an incredible hug tonight, man. How does it taste? It just like salt water. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> salt water. Not too bad. You want to try it? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm OK. Brooklyn, New York. Easy, easy. Pull. Ah, there we go. What sort of taste it tastes like? So, my Okay, great. Thank you, man. It's waiting on you, and it's oh, a girl. Oh, man, you got it, man. Oh, let me get out of the way. Ah. Chris. There you go, bro. Uh. <laughs> I have some repeat customers come here year after year. 
and they ain't gonna buy a salad unless they taste that Viagra first. Oh, yeah. yeah, that keeps. Oh. See, the thing of. The greatest part of it is for the guys that keep everything hard, never go down. <laughs> I'm telling you, man. You guys gotta try it, man. Yes, sir. It's really good, man. Ladies and gentlemen, and that's how we do it in the Bahamas.